Hi, my name is Nick Schaefer. I'm the Director of Career Development at Gwen and Mercy University. Welcome to today's employer meet and greet. We are very excited to be speaking to Brittany from Clifton Larson Allen, CLA. Welcome, Brittany. Hi, Nick. Thanks for having me today. And we are excited to talk to you about some general information about CLA and some information about jobs and internships. So let's get started. Brittany, can you tell us a little bit about CLA? Yes. Um, so I, my name is Brittany Robinson. I am a campus recruiter at CLA and I'd love to tell you a little bit of information about the firm. We are a mid to larger size professional services firm. Um, we have over 121 locations throughout the United States. Um, we employ over 7,500 employees and we serve about 232,000 clients. And we provide a lot of services, but one of our largest service lines is our tax audit and accounting service line. Um, we are a top 10 accounting firm, but we also do other things as well. We have a digital service line, cybersecurity, outsourcing, um, human resources. So there's lots of different areas that um, folks can get into that are on the job market. But today, since we'll be focusing on our internships and early career opportunities, um, we'll mostly be focused on the tax and audit side um, because those are the opportunities we have for those early career um, job seekers out there. Thank you for that information. And students, um, as Brittany introduced herself, you could see in the bottom of the screen her contact information and also the website where you can find information on jobs and internships. So Brittany, what are some job and internship opportunities available for students and alumni? Yes, yeah, so we have internships and associate level positions through 2024, which is really exciting. So if a student is even in their sophomore year, so they're still relatively young in their academic journey. If they're interested in CLA, they can get into the pipeline for a summer 2024 internship opportunity, which is really exciting. Like just putting it out there that you are interested and engaged with a, a company early on could really um, reduce some of the stress of the job search. And so we have our internships that are primarily a tax and audit combination. So you'll see it listed on our career page as like internship spring 2023. And so it's listed kind of general generally, but when you see it, you'll know that it's a tax and audit combo. Um, and so one of the great things about that is that you'll get experience in both of those areas. And so while you're learning and growing in those fields, you'll hopefully develop some sort of insight about which one of those trajectory, which one of those trajectories you might want to actually follow as you advance into your career. But we also opened up recently an internal operations um, internship for spring 2023, starting in um, January 2023. Um, so this might be for a student who is interested in accounting or business, but this could also be for someone who um, is of another major as well. And so if you are interested in kind of keeping processes and systems organized, making sure that documents are what they should be, that the client has sent appropriate information, that could be an opportunity for you. Um, and then those tax and audit um, opportunities, of course, that would be best fit for an accounting student or a finance student who has that relevant coursework. Then on our associate level position side, we have opportunities again through 2024, which is really exciting. So depending on that graduation date, you could have um, a job ready for you before you even graduate. And so that would be either the tax or audit side. And as you kind of speak with um, family members in our organization, you would just find out what the need is in the organization at that time, and they will connect you to a particular industry. Great, thank you for that information, Brittany. It's very insightful. Would you encourage if somebody is currently a senior to be looking at the career page right now, or should they wait till next semester? I would encourage them to rate to to not wait. 
um, to look right now, I think time is of the essence. And um, a lot of us are looking at talent earlier than we've ever been. And so if you have an interest in getting connected to a company, whether it's CLA or another company, you want to put yourself out there as early as possible. And so if you have an interest, reach out now, just show that you are interested and engaged and try to get connected to those folks immediately. Thank you. And Brittany, what do you look for in candidates? What do you look for in a resume as far as skills and traits, uh, probably specifically for accounting students? Yeah, that's a, a great question. And I think because we're, we're looking right now at these internships and early career opportunities, what we might be looking for for these particular students may be a little different from our experienced hires. And so I would say someone who is really willing to learn, right, even though you're getting um, real world job experience in an internship, it's still an opportunity to learn and grow. And someone who is also aligned with the CLA values, one of those values is curious and curiosity. So that's a great place to be in when you're in an internship. So are you willing to ask creative questions? Are you really soaking up the knowledge that's um, being shared with you during the process. We also have um, a value in our company that is very collaborative. And so I shared earlier that we have over 121 locations. And even though our we're talking about our Plymouth meeting location today, it does not mean that we're not communicating with and collaborating with the folks in the other locations throughout the US. So are you willing to have those discussions to brainstorm um, and to really have meaningful conversations with people? That's, we work hard, but we also like to enjoy each other's company. And so having those meaningful connections is something that's important to us. Um, and then we're looking, as far as like the technical side, we're looking for someone who has taken some of the relevant coursework. Um, we understand that you might not have the job experience currently, but have you taken financial or managerial accounting? Um, what are some of the skills that you've listed on your resume that could align with the needs that we have? And even if your experiences so far have not been completely aligned, you feel like, what are some of those transferable skills? So have you had opportunities to show leadership, to show organization? Um, and we're really looking for that. If um, a person has any certifications or any um, really expertise in things like Excel or QuickBooks or um, any sort of like accounting programs, that would be a great benefit to list on a resume as well. Thank you. So it sounds like transferable skills are, are vital. And would you encourage students to be involved on campus with student clubs and organizations as well? Absolutely. I think that recruiters are looking for a well-rounded student, a student who has um, a very holistic college experience. And so part of that is being involved. And I understand that not everyone wants to be on a student organization's e-board, but if you are an active member, if you are going to the meetings, if you're part of those conversations, that's still valuable and we want to know about it. Great. Thank you for those tips. Mm -hmm. um, Brittany, going a step further, what is the interview process like? Yes, yeah, so if you go on our website and you see a career opportunity that you are interested in, you will fill out that application and then someone on our campus team will make sure to review that application. Um, and if we feel that you could be a good fit, you would be contacted for a phone screening. Um, and if you make it through the phone screening, then we will connect you with one of our client serving um, team members who will conduct the final round interview. So if you are an intern, if you're applying for an internship, it'll be one interview with client serving team members. If you are applying for that um, full-time entry-level position, it will be two interviews with um, those client serving team members. But we don't take up a, a lot of um, everyone's time. We know that that's very precious and valuable. So those interviews are typically no more than 30 minutes. And you, you sort of uh, mentioned this, but students, 
and or candidates should go to that bottom website, right? The career page. Yes, thank you so much for pointing that out. Just go to this um, link right here, www.claconnect.com forward slash en forward slash careers. Um, and then you'll specify the early careers or early profession opportunities. Um, and then you can look up Plymouth Meeting PA. That's where we're located. Um, and so those opportunities would be you know, for Gwinnett Mercy students, the Plymouth meeting location, our opportunities would be the most relevant. Great. And Brittany, is there anything else that you would like to add? Yeah, I just want to share that we're always excited to bring on new and excited um, talent into our organization. Um, CLA has been certified as a great place to work. Um, and I will share that I'm newer at CLA, so I think that I have an, an interesting perspective about it. And everyone has been just so kind and patient and very just open and willing to, to answer questions. And I think that's very important for someone who could potentially be new to a company, right? Just knowing that you're going to be cared for. Um, we have very meaningful conversations about what it means to be balanced and well. And so I think that that's also significant in the workplace. You're there to do a job, but you also want to feel supported and like there are systems and structures in place that will actually um, allow you to prioritize your well being. And so that's available as well. And there are lots of opportunities for growth. So if you have an internship and it goes really well, you might be offered an opportunity for a full-time position once you graduate. And once you get into those full-time roles, there are opportunities for advancement um, in whatever way you see fit. So it's really a like um, design your own journey kind of thing at CLA, um, which is really exciting because you have the, the opportunity to really pivot in a lot of different areas within the same company. Great. Thank you for your time, Brittany. Uh, we really appreciate all the tips and information about CLA. Thank you, Nick. It was nice to meet you. And students, for other employer meet and greets, please go to our YouTube page where you will find a number of different uh, employer meet and greets from different industries. Thanks again, Brittany, for your time. We, we appreciate it. Thank you.